Hello everyone, this is Indra working as assistant professor in department of nutrition and dietetics at KASR College of Arts and Science for Women. Today we are going to discuss about diet in cardiovascular disease, hypertension, abnormally high blood pressure and combination of high psychological stress are known as hypertension. Blood pressure, it is the force of blood pushing against the wall of arteries as it flows through them. Arteries are the blood vessels that carry oxygenated blood from the heart to the body tissues. High blood pressure is not a disease but only a symptom indicating that some underlying disease is progressing. Types of hypertension. When genetic predisposition causes hypertension, it is called primary hypertension. High blood pressure caused by medication or illness, it is called secondary hypertension. Causes. Several causes includes cardiovascular disease, renal disease, Tumors of brain, hypothyroidism or disease of ovary and pituitary leads to hypertension. Apart from aging, obesity, alcohol consumptions, soil sensitivity and a person's individual dietary choices may influence the hypertension risk. Nearly half of the diabetic patients are also hypertensive. Symptoms Headache, dizziness, impaired vision, failing memory, shortness of breath, pain over the heart and just a gastrointestinal disturbance. Dietary management for hypertension. Low calorie that is 2 kilocalories per kg body per kg body weight is recommended. Low fat 20 gram of vegetable oil is permitted. Low sodium that is 2 to 3 gram per day is advisable. Normal protein 60 gram per day is enough. A commonly used term that is dash in nowadays DASH means dietary approaches to stop hypertension. DASH diet includes high amount of fruits and vegetables, inclusion of fish, inclusion of low fat food, reduction of fat intake, reducing sodium. Atherosclerosis, it is a disease in which plague buildups inside the arteries. Plague is a sticky substance made up of fat, cholesterol, calcium and other substances found in the blood. Over time, plague hardens and narrows the arteries. That limits the flow of oxygen rich blood to the body. Causes It can be caused without any reason. Among 300 apparently healthy people, 52% suffered from atherosclerosis. It was in 80% of older persons affected more than the teenagers. Symptoms Chest pain or angina pain in the leg, arm, and anywhere else that has a blocked artery. Shortness of breath, fatigue, confusion which occurs if the blockage affects the circulation to the brain. Muscle weakness in the legs due to lack of circulation. Atherosclerosis is a slow, progressive disease that may start in the childhood. Atherosclerosis is preventable. Risk factors from this include smoking, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, diabetes, abdominal obesity, stress, not eating more fruits and vegetables, excess alcohol intake, not exercising regularly or the people affected from this kind of disease. Angina pectoris. Angina, it is a type of chest pain caused by reduced blood flow to the heart. Angina is a symptom of coronary heart disease that, it, that is heart disease. Angina is also called angina pectoris. It is often described as squeezing, pressure, heaviness, tightness or pain in the chest types stable angina unstable angina variant angina refractory angina symptoms angina symptoms include chest pain and discomfort the chest pain or discomfort may feel like burning fullness pressure and squeezing dietary management for heart disease low calorie low fat that is Particularly low saturated fat, low trans fat, low cholesterol and high in polyunsaturated fatty acid foods are recommended. Low carbohydrate, normal protein, minerals and vitamins are advisable. High fiber rich diet which increase the amount of antioxidants. Thank you.